Hello there, everyone. I hope you are doing well. So, as you can see in the in the title, uh, this video is regarding on how you can resize your bootcamp partition without losing your uh, Windows installation and all the data that you have on bootcamp. So the procedure is very simple. Let's go ahead. Uh, by the way, I'm running macOS uh, Catalina. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's go to Disk Utility. This is in Portuguese, guys, but. Uh, I will translate. So, you know, you have my three volumes, okay? Uh, first of all, don't forget to back up your data, okay? Uh, I will not be responsible if you lose any of your important data, okay? Go ahead, make a backup, and then follow all the steps uh, of this video. First, I recommend for you to make a first aid on your main, on your Mac, okay? Let's go ahead make here a first aid this should be uh, quick okay just to keep safe make that first aid okay very well next step you go and partition partition not add value uh, volumes partition and then you click on your Mac, Mac OS click plus give it a name let's go ahead new uh, the format keep it on fat okay MSTOS fat and now give it I don't know let's put here about 60 gigs I think that's the amount that's not necessary for me right now so let's go ahead and apply everything seems to be okay my bootcamp is only 129 okay very well let's click apply this will take a little bit and i hope the screen recording that doesn't shatter stutter sorry and let's continue guys i'll, I'll speed a little bit this up because it will take a little a little bit okay so be right back okay here we are with the partitions that are created okay this will disappear afterwards so now let's go ahead and boot into windows and i'll be right back so guys here we are on the our bootcamp partition let's go ahead let's check here my pc okay uh, i have only 72 uh, gigs available let's go ahead now and see what uh, you have to download it is free okay it, it is called a mini tool partition wizard okay in this case is the 12 this is free and i'll leave the link in the description okay guys now let's open it and here it appears all the partitions that we have on our main disk in this case upon my apple ssd okay so here it is the bootcamp partition and here is the partition that we made okay it was about 60 but now it's 55 and it is here fat 32 okay guys now what you have to do is go ahead and delete in order to be uh, not allocated okay and now you go and click on the bootcamp and move and resize and what you have to do as you can see this free space and located sp space go ahead and do this and click okay and now you have everything here on the bootcamp and you have to apply it's strongly great recommend to close all, all your applications okay very well let's go ahead click proceed and now it will restart and i will show you also what you will see it will restart on windows and i will show you what will appear on your um, uh, startup okay let's go ahead then so now windows it's restarting as you can see i'm not messing around that's my macbook that's my apple cinema display let's go ahead and you will see as you can see resize partition okay this is what you will see on your screen okay don't worry this will reboot on windows again okay so i'll be right back so here we are again Let's go ahead again to my uh, PC and now I have 
127 gigs available okay guys so this is uh, the way that you can um, increase your bootcamp partition without losing uh, all uh, the windows and all the prog programs that you have installed okay guys so thank you very much and um, if you want to see how you can revert the situation without losing any data on your mac i'll do the same video go ahead click on that subscribe button and that for now that's all stay safe see you on the next one bye bye